The Elite Development Squad were looking to continue their bright start to the second phase of the Barclays Under-21 Premier League when they faced Newcastle on Saturday the 8th of March. Despite a loss last time out to Reading, City still sat joint top of their group with opponents Newcastle three points behind them. The Blues started very brightly and created numerous early chances. Firstly, Marcus Lopez shot narrowly wide on the turn and five minutes later, Devante Cole blasted the rebound over under pressure from the Magpies' defence. Next, it was Suarez's turn to try his luck, but this time the Newcastle keeper made a good save to his left. Lombardo's Blues continued to dominate in the second half. Albert Rusnak received the ball on the right and whipped in a brilliant curling cross, which narrowly oh. evaded two City players in the box. Newcastle did start to see more of the ball as the half wore on and were only denied a certain goal by a fantastic block from Greg Lee. Goalkeeper Ian Lawler was in the side to replace Arik Johansson, who's gone on loan to Scunthorpe. Lawler's save on the 58th minute mark kept the score at nil each, but there was nothing he could do about the goal which finally broke the deadlock, a looping volley from number eight, Shane Logan. Lombardo responded by replacing Suarez with Seco Fofana, who came on to make his debut. It was almost an instant impact as the midfielder's oh. shot went just wide. Jose Angel Pozo and Olivier and Cham also came off the bench and the substitutes combined to give Cham the chance to shoot. His brilliant effort was denied by the post, but Cole was prevented from tabbing in when he was fouled. <laughs> Marcus Lopez stepped up and coolly slotted home the penalty to make it one each. Lopez then broke from his own half and played in Pozo, who had the chance to win it, but was denied by the legs of the keeper. <sighs> one each was the final score, and Lombardo's men will look forward to a trip to Norwich on the 18th of March.